Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here, a very good morning to you all, I hope you're all well at home, and here we go then, a new week begins on the channel. Coins to one side, I really do wish everyone the best of weeks, and again, as a little added bonus, I hope you maybe find those commemoratives that you have been looking for. Everyone seems to be finding it quite hard at the moment to find those commemorative coins. Royal Mint, we know you're listening now. Come on, let's get some more commemoratives. Maybe even some of those new coins out into UK circulation. Again, last year we had the Atlantic Salmon. It could well be one of the rarest 50Ps to ever be released. But we're still missing every other denomination. And I really do believe that it's time that we started to see a few of those as well. Again, everyone's super excited for them. And sometimes, before we get to that, Sometimes we find a commemorative. There's another pride coin. Sometimes when people have just been waiting so long for them to actually get out into circulation, people aren't really that fussed about them anymore. So Royal Mint, before everybody loses faith on the new coin designs, come on, let's see them get out into circulation. Even if it was only one before the end of the year, I'm pretty sure everyone would still be excited. My question to everyone in this video, and again, I love to ask everyone really one question per coin hunt video. The question I have for everyone at home is this. How many commemoratives have you dropped? <laughs> My question to everyone at home. Which is your favourite design of the new coins to be released into UK circulation. Come on, let's hear it. For me personally, I really do like the two Bs, but I do think that possibly the two Bs could have been released on the two pound coin, two Bs, two pounds. However, that's maybe me just being a little bit mean as we pick up the 2019 Sherlock Holmes. Let us know your favorite of the coin designs in the comments. Also, for a little bit of fun, if maybe you could change one of the coin designs and put something else in, that would definitely be an interesting one to see some comments on that one. What would your swap be and what would you be swapping your coin in for? Get to the bag. Bag number six. We'll do a few more. We'll just see whereabouts we're up to at the moment. We have got the Sherlock Holmes. We have got the Tale of Peter Rabbit. We've also got the Pride 50 pence. For those of you who haven't found the infamous 2023 Salmon 50p coin, sure there's still some of them out there. But again, if it does only have a mintage figure of half a million, I'm sure I would believe that there's 400,000 of them now in people's collections, sat in bags at home, waiting for those infamous mintage figures to be released from the Royal Mint. We should be getting them. I, I do believe it is around September usually when they do update them on the website. You can correct me if I am wrong. But again, is it even that far away now? And I know I probably shouldn't be saying it, but it won't be long, I can promise you, before Christmas is here. Here we go then, the first of the 13 Beatrix Potter coins to be released for circulation. It's a Beatrix Potter anniversary. Silhouette of Beatrix Potter features at the top of the coin. Peter Rabbit is at the bottom. I do think the little one has just woke up from his nap. So that will be the end of this one. But we will try and get some bigger coin hunts up later on today. Four coins then. The Tale of Peter Rabbit, the Beatrix Potter Anniversary, two of the Potters, the Pride Coin and the Sherlock Holmes. Get your star find in the comments section. I am a sucker for the Beatrix Potter Anniversary. I think it is a stunning design and what a way to start off that Beatrix Potter coin set. Again, apologies for not many longer coin hunts over the course of probably the last month. We are going to get back into them. This will be probably one of the shorter ones in the future. We'll be on to the hundreds, 250 pound of coin hunts. And again, we will get stuck in and really stay consistent with the bigger ones. More finds, bigger hunts, more excitement, hopefully, for you guys at home. Stay safe, fun as always, guys. Thanks for watching.